Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's me Hannah here and thank you so much for joining me today. So today I have a really really exciting video. I mentioned this on Instagram so if you don't follow me on Instagram go ahead and follow me. It's Hannah Hearts X. I'll leave it in the description. But um, I placed a massive River Island sale order. Now um, the package came yesterday so I'm trying to film this as soon as possible because the sale went on on I think I want to say Thursday or Wednesday of this week. So I decided to um, put in a big order and see kind of what pieces look good, what pieces are not so good so that you kind of know what the best sale picks are. Now there's this coat that I've been wanting for such a long time from River Island but it was £120 and it was like one of those blogger coats, like every blogger has this coat and they had it for winter and I thought you know what I really want that coat and it was on sale for £38 so I thought you know what I'm going to get it and I'm going to try it. Now I've tried everything on and girl i'm a size 20 22 i got everything in an 18 the majority of things in an 18 and the majority of them didn't fit which i'm really upset about <laughs> so i mean whatever it's fine but if you are a size 18 then i'm sure all of this stuff would be gorgeous some of the stuff fits some of it didn't some i got from the river island plus section so obviously stay tuned and watching for that stuff but this is a blog court the one that everybody was wearing this year it was this um shearling faux fur or whatever you want to call it borg i don't even know this kind of sheep shearling type of um coat with these suede or very soft leather patches um all the way down oh it's such a gorgeous coat i mean this was the coat of the season it was really really gorgeous everyone was wearing neutrals in the winter and it just looked amazing and i thought you know what i need that coat unfortunately it doesn't fit <laughs> i bought it in a size 18 um it was originally 120 pounds i think i got it for 38 pounds and it doesn't fit me it doesn't close and it's not one of those courts that you can get away with like you know if it doesn't close you can kind of get away with it this isn't one of those courts so unfortunately i have to send this one back so if you are a size 18 i don't know if it's still on stock in stock on the website but obviously when i send it back it'll get re-uploaded onto the website so keep some notifications on if you do want to get that coat i'd say even if you were a true size 20 the coat would probably fit you because um it's not too small you know i feel like if i was a size down it'd fit me but it don't fit so <laughs> it's getting sent back and then i ordered another coat which is absolutely gorgeous the color is insane let me get it out and show you oh again doesn't fit i feel like my friend sunny would look beautiful in this coat it's a size 18 originally 100 pounds and i got it for i think 30 pounds and the color is beautiful gorgeous it's a beautiful really good quality coat um if they did this in the plus section i would have got it in a size 22 or a size 20 whichever one which was whichever one was available this was 30 quid it's really long so it is like a maxi coat so i think even if it did fit me i don't know if i'd keep it because it is really really long but it's just gorgeous the colors are gorgeous and again this is one of those that i can't get away with like i tied the belt in the try on and it looks really cute but you can tell like it needs to be closed it's a double breasted coat so it just doesn't fit the shoulders fit perfect this is a problem with me my shoulders are a size 18 like honestly um i don't have a very wide frame up at the top so when i get something that's like a size 22 24 whatever the shoulders are always hanging off you know whereas um on a size 18 the shoulder is always in the place that it's supposed to be so with this coat the shoulders the upper part is perfect it's just obviously when it gets to the belly area it ain't closing <laughs> so um yeah so that was 30 quid and i'm just i'm so disappointed that it doesn't fit my mum bought this coat for herself um and it's obviously gonna fit her because she's like a size 12 so so super jealous of her um, and of, of anyone that gets this coat in the sale i'm sending it back oh, I'm just throwing them all behind me anyways um then i got some of these some of these some slippers um i'll quickly show you these and then move on to the, obviously the clothing items so i got these slippers these i got in a size large or a seven eight because i'm a size seven now after pregnancy it used to be a size six <laughs> um <laughs> they're gorgeous i really really like them they were originally 22 pounds i got them for nine quid i have bought them um i bought them originally for myself but now i'm thinking do i save them as like a birthday present for one of my friends throughout the year you know they're brand new obviously 
Um, but they were nine pounds, and they're such a cute gift if you're gonna do like a hamper for a friend, like a spa hamper, put some face masks in there, etc. A really nice pair of slippers is a good way to go. So I might save that for a friend. Then I bought this blazer. This again is in a size 18. And I need your help, guys. Now, this is where I need your help. Um, this blazer doesn't, like, it doesn't look too small. Do you know what I mean? Like, when a blazer can look too small and too tight on the arms, which I do have one of those. I'll show you in a minute. Um, but it doesn't close, but it looks really smart on. Um, it's a size 18, as I said. It's the sage green blazer. I've never had a blazer this colour. I got one from Shein um, last year. It was a lot thinner. I didn't have any lining. And it was a little bit darker than this and a little bit more minty. Whereas this is a true sage green colour. So I really, really love the colour of it. Um, it has ruched sleeves as well. Just the quality of River Island blazers can't be matched. Like, I love their blazers. Um, it's better than H&M quality or any other kind of quality that I've tried. This was originally £65. I think I got it for 20 or 25 So please tell me, should I keep this or not? Have a look at it and what it looks like in the try-on. Do you think I should keep it? I'm thinking yes, but am I only thinking yes because it was so cheap? Or am I thinking yes because it looks good, you know? Do you know like when something's so cheap you're just like, I'm going to keep it because it was only 20 quid. I'm going to keep it because it was only 10 quid. Stuff like that. Um, that's kind of what's putting me off. Like I'm like, am I actually keeping it because it looks good? Or am I keeping it because it was cheap? Then this blazer fits me at the waist. So it actually closes, but it's too tight on the arms. It's like when I do this, it's like getting really bulgy and tight. It's a cropped blazer in this like, I don't even know what color this is. It's a mix between camel and like green, I don't know. It looks camel on, on the camera, but it's more of like a diarrhea color. <laughs> it's like a weird brown color, like a yellowy, yellowy brown, I don't know. But it's a cropped blazer, you can see there, so it's cropped. It hits you at the waist, it's single breasted. The button does do up, but the sleeves are a little bit tight. And I'm like, all I've got on in the try on, I think, was a vest with no like shirt or anything. So if I had something that I had that had long sleeves, I don't think it would fit. So I think this one's gonna go back. Um, I got it in size 18 again. 60 pounds, I think again, this was down to around 20 pounds, if not less. I just don't like the color of this. I think even if it did fit, I probably won't keep it because the color is like, it's a little bit, yeah, it's like a, dirty mustard color like i don't know how to describe the color to you but again this is probably one that's going to go back i'm really thinking to keep that sage green one guys please let me know in the comments do you think i should keep it do you think i should send it back and then another blazer so much out of guys i do have dresses as well but later in the haul later in the haul honey so um i got this tuxedo blazer it's a black blazer i think it was 25 or 30 pounds from 65 again size 18 this one is too big so <laughs> everything too small this one too big it has shoulder pads the shoulder pads make me look very boxy because it is a tuxedo blazer it's supposed to have that like boxy structure style and this one is too big it's very oversized even in the 18 if i got this in a 22 it would be drowning like that's how oversized it is so you know size probably one or two sizes down on this if you were to get this um it's got a lining like a silky black lining you'll see what it looks like it's very oversized but i feel like it's a good overcoat so but then i'm like i don't like the shoulder pads i don't like how boxy it makes me look it's very masculine but then should i wear it for work could i keep it it's good quality guys please help in the comments please help <laughs> the green blazer and this blazer is the one that i need help with do i keep it do i send it back um because i know that once i get on there i'm not going to be able to get it in the 16 probably so i'm like do i keep this or do i send it back this tuxedo blazer it's so big on the shoulders it's very masculine looking but again i don't have a blazer like that it's double breasted it's very smart it's very good quality do i keep it because it was cheap or do i keep it because it looks good let me know in the comments below i don't know um then i have a cute dress i really like this dress sorry everything's in the packaging i've already tried it on <laughs> so i got this which isn't my style because it's snake print mm. um so this is what it looks like i got this in a size 22 from the river island plus section I, it was 48 pounds originally i think i got it for like 15 or 20. so this is what it looks like it's a snake print it's a nude yellow and brown snake print and it's snake print all the way down as well so the whole dress is snake print it's a midi dress and it has two splits in the front can you see the splits the snake print is like making everything more funny it's got two splits in the front and then it comes with a belt now i hate the belt it's one of those that you um 
that has like a buckle it's not like a tie waist type of one it's like one of those buckle ones and i really hate the way these look i think that they make like dresses look really old grannified you know so i'm gonna take that off it does have a stretchy waist at the back not at the front but at the back it has this elastication the rest of it is not stretchy um i think i'm gonna put my own belt with this so i'll probably switch it out for a black belt but i do really like this and i think this would be a really good work piece so i can just shove this on in the spring summer time with a pair of shorts underneath um and because it's long obviously i'm not showing any leg or anything and um i could wear it with just like a cute sandal or something i think that'll be really really nice um, and then let me just check my phone i feel like somebody's messaged me is it my husband no so i don't care um <laughs> and then i have this which is a no from me now i feel like this like riley would look really nice in this um if you follow riley so i feel like this is her style anyway i got this in a size 22 as well it's 55 pounds i think i got it for about 15 20 pounds i feel like this will look really nice on her it's like this lime green um dress it's really nice color is gorgeous pattern is gorgeous it's got that um really angelic gold kind of dots all over it you know it has a puff sleeve look at that sleeve wow gorgeous and then um you've got a belt to kind of cinch you in at the waist and it has a tear at the bottom it just doesn't suit me it doesn't just suit me at all it makes me look very round it makes me look like i don't know i think maybe there's too much fabric i'm not sure it just doesn't suit me um I, plus i don't really like the neckline or anything but i feel like this would look so nice on somebody that can pull off these colors these bright colors i really like this dress like i'm such a big fan again it has a stretchy waist so let me show you it has a stretchy waist little buttons on the front a frill little collar like the detailing of this dress is really really pretty i love the sleeves these big massive puff sleeves just doesn't suit me at all like like I can't even make it work. I've tried putting a different belt on it with it, uh, with it and stuff, and I thought, you know what, I can make this work because it's such a pretty dress. Just doesn't suit me at all in the slightest. Oh, I've got my glasses on. I didn't even realise I had my glasses on my head. Oops. Um, and then I have. Let me get it out. Um, and then I have these. So I have a cord set. This isn't me, is it? This bright pink, but. I love it i'm keeping it i love it it's so nice i feel like this with a pair of chunky white trainers underneath would look so cool like i'd be like who is she she's so cool or i could wear it with like a pointy nude heel i think that would look really cute as well so i'll show you it it, mm, it is a pleated cord set i got the pants in a size 24 um they were originally 32 pounds i think i got them for 10 or 12 pounds um and then i don't like the only thing i don't like is this like elastication this sports looking elasticated waist that it has so i'm going to cover that like with the shirt um it's a wide pleated leg pant really wide fits lovely doesn't show your belly or anything like that and then it comes with a pleated bright pink um well it doesn't come with it comes as separate and i got this in a size i can't see 20 um and this was originally how much i'm sorry i've got a block nose uh 34 pounds got it for 10 or 12 pounds again so it's a pleated pink bright pink with gold buttons shirt um this tucked in like on one side and then like ruched out a little bit i'll show you in the trying of what i mean looks really really nice with the pants you can wear them as separates obviously or you can wear them together i'd probably only wear the top separate i wouldn't wear the pants with something else you know i feel like this together or this with something else so i'm gonna keep both pieces because i do really like it like i said with a pair of chunky white trainers in the springtime would be so cool or if you want to go out for a nighttime look you could chuck on like a really nice um pair of like stiletto nude heels or something um just to kind of peep through the little wide leg um, and i feel like that would be just so easy to chuck on especially on holiday as well i feel like on holiday this would be a gorgeous suit don't you think um <laughs> i'm talking so much um, so yeah so i'm keeping this definitely 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 love it think it looks great um keeping the pants as well wouldn't wear the pants on their own but still keeping it as part of the cardboard and then last item is these trousers the trousers were on sale but the blazer for the trousers weren't on wasn't on sale it was still like 56 pounds i was like no i'm not i'm gonna get that so i thought I'll order the trousers because they were a tenner and i thought if the trousers look wow 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 they're amazing then i thought you know what i'll get i will pay full price for the blazer then but i'm not ordering the blazer for the sake of ordering it just in case the pants don't look nice um so these are the pants got them in a size 24 they are a wide leg 
trouser really cool again could wear with trainers converse chunky white trainers etc but they look disgusting on me first of all they're too long and secondly they're too small on the like belly portion like my belly's like suffocating in there you know it feels like wrapped meat or something <laughs> like my belly's suffocating in these pants but the waist is like too big on me so i've pulled it up and the waist part is too big to the point where the elastic hasn't even stretched because i could pull this up without um opening the button or anything but then the actual belly part is so 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 tight so unfortunately for 10 pound uh, this is one of those that even though it's cheap i'm not keeping it because it looks that bad um but if it looked good i would have bought the blazer to match and it would look so nice um so that's my haul guys there's quite a few items there i'll leave everything linked in the description below please help me should i keep the sage blazer should i keep the black blazer i don't know let me know before say like tuesday wednesday because that's when i'm go i'm gonna go back to town and send all of this back um so like the stuff that i don't like obviously back i'm gonna keep the snake print dress i'm gonna keep the cord i'm gonna keep the slippers i'm gonna keep the um what else am i gonna keep my, um, the sage blade and i'm like blazer maybe i don't know let me know in the comments below anyways hope you enjoyed this video give it a like and a, or I'll give it a thumbs up if you did please subscribe to my channel for more fashion videos next week we'll have probably another sheen video or an asos video um and i'll see you next time bye guys